Hi everyone, good morning, good day. Thank you so much for being here with me today, Saturday. Um, so awesome to have you. Um, today's topic is we're gonna be talking about what happens when you say I do. And coincidentally, my nephew Carlos and his fiance Amanda are getting married today, so that's why I'm in Palm Beach dressed in glitter today. So gonna have an amazing day celebration with family. And, you know, I was thinking about this as I was getting ready for this week and, and all the activities and rehearsal dinner last night and setting up the, uh, the recreation room for their, the ballroom for their, for their spectacular event today. And, you know, a lot of times when we say I do, um, it's, such a, it's such a strong commitment because we feel like we're giving up our lives somehow, that there's a part of us that we're gonna lose. And so that's not what marriage is supposed to be about at all. When you say I do, it's a commitment of love. It's a commitment of, of demonstrating to your partner that you love them enough, that you want to spend your life with them. And But it's not about putting us in a box. And I know that for a lot of us, being in a marriage or being married, um, many times it was about feeling like we're in a box or that we were caged up. I know for me that was something that, that hindered my growth for a very long time. And so um, I'm asking you all that are in a relationship or getting ready to get engaged or married or make these big commitments in your life, whether it is marriage or you're saying I do to a new job or a new career, when you say I do, it just means that you're ready to commit to something that is good for you. It's not supposed to be sacrifice and suffering. And you guys hear me talking about this all the time because that's not the energy that we're in. And sacrificing ourselves or suffering to be somewhere or to be in a situation is never going to have a happy ending. It's never going to be a good thing. So I want you all to assess your relationships with yourself, with your partners, but most importantly to assess when you say, I do, what are you really committing to? And like I said a, a few minutes ago, the I do is not, uh-oh, I did, oh my God, now what? The I do is I do because it comes from love. I do because I want to commit to this new job. I do because I want to commit to this amazing partner and friend and lover. I do want to commit to being a mom or a dad. I do want to be the best that I can be. And so the I do's are not, are not about caging you up. They're not about putting you in a box. They're not about setting all sorts of limits in your life. On the contrary, I do is freedom. I do means that you made a choice to commit to something because it's going to build you up to be a better person, to be a better individual, to be a better a version of yourself. So I'm challenging you guys all this week to realize what are the things that you have committed to, what are the things that you have said I do to, and, and how, how they've changed you, how they've helped you evolve, how they've made you a better person. And if they haven't, then you want to reassess why you said I did or I do if it was going to limit you, if it was gonna put you in a place or in a position that is not comfortable or not good for you or not allowing you to grow and expand and become this much better version of yourself that we're always working on, not working hard, we're working at it. We're just developing, we're evolving, we're helping ourselves to grow. And so I'm leaving you guys with that message today. Obviously, I'm going to have a magical day in the celebration. All the kids are going to be together. So it's a beautiful day for me to celebrate with my family, my children, my niece, my nephews. We're all here to have an amazing day, an amazing time, a time of celebration, of love, of happiness. And more than anything, it's a day of commitment, committing to a day of love and what the future brings and holds for for these beautiful, for the beautiful family that, that I have inherited, that I, that I live in, that I, I'm enjoying and I'm, I'm really um, embracing having all of this family time. And also for Amanda and Carlos, um, wishing them so many beautiful things. And for all the couples out there that are ready to say I do or saying I do or said I do, um, to make sure that you guys are doing it from a place of love, compassion, understanding, and, and evolving to be the best that you both can be. So love you guys. Have a beautiful and amazing week. And um, enjoy your day. Thank you so much. Bye.